So you're finally gonna train me, huh? First, how about a change of scenery? We're going behind the waterfall, bro. You follow? Behind the waterfall? Uh, just curious. Am I coming too? Sure. So, behind the waterfall. First, let's move to the other side. Then I'll show you a shocking surprise. Mm -hmm. Naruto, come on, let's check it out. Oh. Whoa. I had no idea there were these ruins here. So, what kind of training is he going to do? He'll be fighting the Nine Tails here. Huh? Fight the Nine Tails? He doesn't have to do anything excessive, does he? What kind of question is that? Do you think you can achieve tailed beast control without being excessive? Fool? You fool? This is a sacred place where those selected as Jinchuriki have long come to undergo purification ceremonies. But, but... Captain Yamato, I came here to gain control over the Nine Tails' power. I have to do this. I'm not running away. Naruto. Okay, first you need to speak with your tailed beast. Go to that structure just ahead. Got it! Is this? You need to go in there, sit down, close your eyes and focus, and then you'll meet up with your tailed beast. It's about time, you know? Naruto, are, are you sure about this? Yeah, because Yamato was assigned with making sure that Naruto keeps the Ninetales inside him and like locked up and not get out. So you could totally see why Yamato's against this. Once I say I'm going to do something, I never go back on my word. <laughs> okay, now let's go in. Chapter 4, The Birth of Naruto. Listen closely to my tale, yo. Naruto. What sealing jutsu was used to seal the Nine Tails? What sealing jutsu? Um... A tetragram seal. A tetragram seal, huh? Very impressive. A lot more solid than my own steel shell seal. So you have to undo the seal. What if he's not able to control him and the Nine Tails fully manifests? What then? We'll seal him away right here. That's what this place is for as well. Seal him? In here? But... That won't happen! I swear I'll succeed! Naruto... Okay, time to shut the door. Now, I'm gonna tell you how to deal with the Nine Tails. Naruto, you really impressed me. The rules are real simple, see? the nine tails inside your mind. Undo the seal. When the nine tails emerges, grab its chakra with your chakra and pull hard. Chakra can only be captured using chakra. That's how it goes, yo. So steal the nine tails chakra directly from right under his nose. A warning, there's a chance that your chakra might get pulled from you when you try to take his. And you know what happens when your entire chakra is taken from you and dropped to zero, right? Yeah, don't let that happen. Tailed beast, nine tails. Yo, spooky glare as usual. Naruto, you... Where the real you go, I don't sense him. I'm right here. Right in front of your eyes. Haven't you figured it out already? 
I'm oh, half expecting a jump scare. You're hoping to gain control over my power. Overcoming Hatred, Naruto versus the Ninetales. Keep health gauge at 60% or more, and we gotta win. Duh. This should be fun. Yo, Naruto, I wanna help you fight, yo. All <laughs> what right. What the hell? <laughs> With Octopop's help, I could tip the balance in my favor. In that case, I'll... Ultimate decision. Use your own strength. In this fight, retreat is impossible. Faced with the beast, your will only burns hotter. Challenge the Ninetales by yourself. Powerful tag team. A fight where retreat is impossible. Accept Killer Bee's help and show them what this new master and student can do. Let me see what he says. Using Octopop's help is a good idea. But... I want to do this on my own. Right? Like, that would be way more interesting. I can't lose this fight. Two people will seal the deal better than just one. Mm. You know what? We got to keep the theme with the knuckle-headed Naruto. He would want to do this by himself anyways, so we're going legend. This is going to be a hard fight Sorry, now. Sorry, Octopops, but let me take care of this on my own. Down the path of training, you dare to walk alone. But the extent of your power is still unknown. Okay, no doubt you can work it out, so I'll just let it stand. I'll give you advice instead of a hand. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks a lot. <laughs> no problemo. My hand kind of freaks me out anyway. Gutsy attitude. I sure am a nice dude. Good luck. <sighs> Overcoming Hatred, Beware Attacks, Hit Face. Defeat the Ninetales one-on-one. -on -one. The Ninetales attacks are powerful and tough to guard against. Be careful, some are actually impossible to guard against. To attack its weak spot, press double A quickly to get close with Ninja Dash, then hit its face. Let the battle begin. Listen, what you need to do isn't that difficult. Stealing the Ninetale chakra is the goal of this battle. You know, but he's strong as ever. Reducing his strength is your first priority. Otherwise, you can't take his chakra, you see. The nine tails attack is pretty wet. It's true. You gotta dodge it and get closer while keeping it. Oh. Oh. Ow. Is nothing compared to mine. Well, that's the point. I can't want your power. To this monster of a fox! Ow. Ow. Oh my god. This is gonna be hard. This is a really dope battlefield. dealt with the hatred in me. I'm most likely not getting this bonus requirement, but it's fine. As long as we win. I pushed the wrong button again, but okay. Button time. You're mine now! Gotcha! Not expect that.
What is this? Uh-oh. You stay here. Don't go anywhere. Oh, snap. Naruto. Uh, huh? Where'd you come from? And how come you know my name? Uh, of course. Well then, why don't you guess who I am, Naruto? <laughs> Don't tell me. You got it? You! You're the Nine Tails true form! Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> That's a scary laugh! Trying to trick me by taking that form? You're wrong, you know! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> uh. <sighs> Oops, sorry about that. Sheesh! That hurt, you know. You know... I was born impatient. I talk so fast that sometimes weird things come out of my mouth, you know? I've been trying to stop, but when I get excited, I just say whatever I'm thinking. I hope you came out okay, without any weird verbal quirks like me. Oh, so that's who you got it from. Then... Minato didn't say anything to you? <laughs> Shame on him. That's right. I am your... I've... It's his mom. Wanted to meet you for so long, you know? Mom. You know, huh? You really are my child. Curse you. Keeping me bound like this with your abominable chakra. Kushina! Mom? Hmm? <laughs> Nothing. Naruto, have you met your father, Minato? Dad? Dad once appeared and stopped the Ninetales during one of his rampages. I was really surprised when I saw him, too. Hmm. Speaking of which, why did you... Minato included my chakra in the ceiling jutsu, so I'd appear when you tried to control the Ninetales. So that I could lend you a hand. Right. What is it? Is there something on my face? No, no, it's just... I... I was thinking about how lucky I am to have such a beautiful mom. Oh, <laughs> well, thank you. You have your father's hair, but I'm sorry you got stuck with my face, Naruto. Why? I got my good looks from you, right? 
I even wish I'd gotten your straight red hair. It's totally awesome. <laughs> that makes you the second man who has complimented my red hair. Yeah? So who's the first? Who do you think? Your father, of course. Oh, right. What is it? Hey, hey, there's something I've always wanted to ask you. How did you and Dad fall in love? It's a bit embarrassing, you know? Hey, you said you know. You're getting excited again. You say I'm getting flustered, not excited, you know? You said it again! <laughs> When we first met, your father Minato and I were both still little kids. I had just moved from another village and entered the academy as a new transfer student. At the time, I was placed in the same class as Minato. My first impression of him was that he seemed rather girly and undependable. He said he wanted to become a Hokage, respected by everyone in the village, but it just sounded like a joke to me. What? But Dad seemed so powerful! I know, but I was still young and didn't know anything back then, so I looked down on Minato. Until a certain incident happened. An incident? I used to really hate my red hair. After that incident, I started to like it. What happened? I have a slightly special chakra, and I was kidnapped by the Hidden Cloud Village because of it. You were kidnapped? They suddenly captured me and took me away to the Hidden Cloud Village. And I wasn't able to put up much of a fight. But I knew I had to do something in order to leave behind a trail while I was being led away. I snipped off and dropped strands of my hair, carefully, so the enemy wouldn't notice. The Hidden Leaf Village immediately put together search parties, but they had a hard time finding me. We were almost to the border, and I thought that I was done for. But then... Was that when... Yep. Minato was the one who rushed to my side and rescued me. He was the only one to notice the strands of my red hair. He told me it was because my hair is so pretty. Oh. That day, I knew Minato really would be a great ninja. I realized he could make all my dreams come true, and that he could change me. The red hair that I had always hated had brought me the man of my dreams. My hair became my red thread of destiny. After that, I grew to like my hair, and more importantly, fell in love with Minato. There are certain words I only bestow on the men who compliment my hair. Will you accept them? Huh? Naruto, I love you. I love you. Wow. I'm just I sad that his so parents are calm. dead. And so happy. <laughs> Start screaming. <laughs> Finish this fight. Now's my chance. I'm ready. I'm gonna win this battle. Let the 
Battle begin. Now we have mom's help. Ah! Stay calm. If you carefully watch his movements, you'll spot an opening. Like that. Oh god. Oh, that's what she does. Cool. Thanks, mom. Naruto, are you okay? He's strong, you know. Watch out! Chakra tug of war. Increased chakra used ninjutsu. In this battle, sometimes button input displays will appear on the nine tails. Get close to that part and input the buttons to trigger a short IA. If you input the buttons, you'll steal chakra from the nine tails and be able to use an ultimate jutsu. Jutsu activated. YYB. Watch out. Here I come. Shut up, phone. Oh. Take this. Rasenga Super Mario. Where did you get that? Has he always said, you know this often? This to me. I'll stop him. Now, get him. Going, Mom. More buttons. Way cooler to do with his mom than with the uh, killer bee. Oh shit. <laughs> Let's go. C rank. Oh god. I thought I did decent. Well, I actually took a lot more health than I intended. Oh my goodness. C, C rank. You know what? It was a legend battle. I think I did pretty good. I'm gonna give myself an S rank. Screw you, game. And we got a ninja info card. And another one. And another one. And another one. Oh my god, how many are there? It's still going. Play stop. You dare. Yup. You still have this much power? Wow, you really are amazing. But sorry.
I promise I won't do wrong by you. So just hang in there for a little while. You did it, Naruto. Yeah. Hm? Mom, what are you... Now, I can finally join Minato. <sighs> but before I go, there are some things I need to tell you. Huh? About the incident that happened 16 years ago when you were born. I'm going to tell you the truth about that day. The day the Ninetales attacked? Starting with the fact that the Jinchuriki of the Ninetales before you was me. You... Mom? You were... the Ninetales Jinchuriki? Yes. I was brought to the Leaf from the now-vanished Hidden Eddy Village to become the Ninetales Vessel. The Ninetales. Whoa, hold on a minute! They brought you here from another village? And... What do you mean by... Vessel? The clan folk of my village excelled at sealing jutsu, and had a very close relationship with the Hidden Leaf. I had a particularly powerful chakra, strong even for one from my village, enough to suppress the Ninetales. So that's why you... were chosen to be the Ninetales Vessel? Yes. What? What was wrong with them? They weren't even treating you like a person! I was brought to the Hidden Leaf Village without being told the truth, so I was shocked as well when I found out. The burden of being a Jinchuriki, the loneliness. I nearly collapsed under all the expectations. But during that difficult time, the Jinchuriki before me, Lady Mito Uzumaki, told me that I may have come here to be a vessel like her. But the key was to fill ourselves with love first. Then, even if we had to live as the Ninetales Jinchuriki, we could still be happy. So, Mom, you were a Jinchuriki, but you were happy? Yep. Oh, Naruto. There's no need for you to cry. Wait. What is it? Dad said that when the Ninetales attacked the Hidden Leaf Village, it was because of that masked Akatsuki guy. So how come you didn't have the Ninetales, Mom? Your father left a few things out, I guess. Oh, that's right. Minato didn't have that much time with you. It's true that when the Ninetales attacked the village 16 years ago, a masked man was behind it. But up until right before that, the Ninetales was sealed inside me. So what happened? That masked man... I don't know how, but... He knew. Knew what? The one time a Jinchuriki's seal weakens, he exploited that weakness. ...and stole the Ninetales from me. The one time the seal weakens? When's that? Childbirth. Oh, oh. During the nine months or so between when a female Jinchuriki gets pregnant and gives birth... ...the energy that is normally used for the seal is diverted to the growing baby. ...and the tailed beast seal tends to weaken proportionally. It was October 10th, 16 years ago. By order of the third Hokage, I was to give birth inside a barrier at a distance from the village. This measure was taken in case the seal came undone when I gave birth... ...and the Nine Tails got out. Minato was going to be there for the birth... ...and the preparations were progressing smoothly. Everything related to the birth, though, was top secret. Oh, snap. In that case, I'll go on ahead. You'll be okay, right? If the contractions start, get someone nearby to help, okay? I'll rush back to help out, too, as soon as I can. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it.
Ninja will meet you at the Hidden Leaf Gate, so be sure to have them accompany you, understand? And... Minato? You're treating me like a child. No, that's not how I meant it. It's just... That overprotective habit of yours is never gonna change, is it? Don't worry, I'm okay. So go on ahead and get everything set up already. Kushina. Listen, we're about to be parents. If we freak out about everything, Naruto will just laugh at us. Yeah, I guess so. We can't look weak in front of Naruto. Exactly. Okay, fine. I'm going on ahead then. I'll see you later. In oh, sorry. Good grief. <laughs> Well, I can kind of understand panicking a bit in this kind of situation, but in just a little while, we'll be able to meet you. And so I headed off toward the barrier. Minato and some other medical ninja joined me inside the barrier, and then I went into labor. To be honest, I was a bit anxious since it was my first time, and I was worried about the seal, too. But Minato was there by my side through the whole thing. He helped me feel like everything was going to be okay. Dad. And then things got... Uh, pretty rough. You being a guy and all, I don't think you'd be able to understand. I'm a woman. I understand. Well, I've never had a child, but I still understand. <laughs> I guess it was tough, even for you, Mom. You better believe it. I was going through childbirth, after all. It hurt like crazy. It took forever for you to come out, and the Nine Tails went berserk. But, little by little, I was filled with happiness that I was having a baby. And then, with a strong little cry, you were born. <laughs> I'm a father now! Naruto, we finally meet. Look at the tiny little hands. Alright, I know it's rough having just given birth, but we need to completely suppress the Nine Tails again. <laughs> Fourth Hokage Minato, step away from the Jinchuriki. Or else this child will die after its first minute. Wh who are you? <coughs> Kushina! The Nine Tail Seal! Hurry up and move away from the Jinchuriki. Don't you care what happens to your little brat? Hey. Wait! Stay calm! Speak for yourself. I am supremely calm. <laughs> Impressive, however. Paper bombs! Minato! Naruto! Bill, <laughs> Naruto's not hurt. How the he forced fudge? me to use the flying rising jutsu. His target was Kushina, so he separated us. Oh. Gotta hurry. Do you want? I'm going to extract the nine tails from you and crush the leaf. What? <laughs> the nine tails seal has weakened due to childbirth, and that troublesome Minato is now far away. There's no one around to save you. <laughs> Do you know how long I have waited for this? <laughs> Stop. Come on out, Nine Tails. This leads to the beginning of the game. Now to take care of the leaf. Wait. 
My, my, my. You Uzumaki clan are just amazing. You don't die right away when the tailed beast is extracted. You were his Jinchuriki. I'll let you die by his hand. <coughs> They don't call you Flash for nothing, but you're too late. Miyato... Naruto... Is Naruto... all right? Yeah, he's fine. He's in a safe place right now. Thank goodness. Mirato, you've got to stop that man and the Nine Tails. They're planning to hit the Hidden Leaf Village. He flew away again. Oh well. Just be with Naruto. Naruto. Mirato. Thank you. Good luck. Be right back. Did you notice me? Look at you, Minato. You've already lost your head over this baby. No, I just thought Naruto would like it, you know? I can't believe you bought that when he hasn't even been born yet. You're really being hasty, you know. That is so Naruto, normal to buy kids. Be I your mean, mom's saying this, but you buy kids. really like it, right? <laughs> I meant buy toys before kids are born. Uh, d did you... Yep. He moved. <laughs> See? I told you he'd like it. Come on, it was just a coincidence. I don't care what the reason was, as long as Naruto's happy. Minato, what are you going on about? You and I are gonna have lots of fun after you're born, okay, Naruto? <laughs> That's right. After you're born, we'll always be together.
Minato, where are you? Watch out! Look. Your father... ...bought this... ...for you. Don't worry. Everything's going to be okay. I'm gonna be a dad soon. So, which one of us do you think he'll take after more? Doesn't matter. He's our son. Naruto, I can't wait to meet you. Yeah, I hope we can see each other soon, Naruto. No. Um, sorry. Minato, you teleported the Nine Tails with you? I managed to get this far. But I don't have much chakra left. Tails with me to my death. So that the interval until he emerges again is delayed. It's all I can manage right now with my remaining chakra to help you two. Thank you for everything. Up till now. <laughs> Q 
Kushina, you are the one who made me the fourth Hokage, who made me a man. And made me this child's father. And yet I'm useless. So sad. I, I'm happy. I'm loved by you. Plus, today is the child's birthday. So, most of all, if I were to imagine me alive and our future together as a family of three, then I can't see us being anything but happy. But if I were allowed just one regret, I wish I could have seen Naruto grow up. Kushina, there's no need for you to die to kill the Nine Tails. Preserve what little of your chakra remains. For your reunion with Naruto. Huh? I'm going to seal the rest of your chakra inside Naruto. It'll be part of an eight signed ceiling. And then I'll take the Nine Tails with me. With the sealing jutsu that I can do, not being a Jin Shuriki. Reaper Death Seal. But that jutsu results in the caster's death. One more thing. I'm only going to seal away half of the Nine Tails. Partly because it's physically impossible to seal away so much power, but also because it's not strategically wise. If the Nine Tails is lost along with you, there will be no Jin Shuriki until he re-emerges, upsetting the balance. With the Reaper Death Seal, we can at least seal away half of the Nine Tails forever. And... The other half. World upheaval and calamities. So the savior that will emerge then is the child of prophecy? And you think that child is me? going to seal inside Naruto using the eight sign sealing. <laughs> I know what you're going to say. But remember what Master Jiraiya said about world upheaval and the calamities that will accompany that. There are two things that I've become convinced of today. That masked man who attacked you, he will bring catastrophe to this world. This child will stop him. He will open up the future as a Jinchuriki. I don't know how, but I'm sure of it. But, Minato! Alright, I guess I'm not as mad as Minato at Minato anymore. Let's believe in him. Oh, shit. After all, he is our son. It's because he's our son that I don't want him to bear such a heavy burden. And why the Reaper Death Seal? I want you to stay with Naruto and watch over his development. Why? Why does Naruto have to be sacrificed for the tail beast balance, for the country, for the village? And why do you have to sacrifice yourself for my sake? Forsake one's country and one's village 
is the same as forsaking one's child. You, whose birth nation is no more, know that all too well. How harsh life is for those without a land to call home. Besides which, our family, our ninja. Finally, even if I were to live, I'd lose out to you. <laughs> even though you won't have much time with him, there are things only you can tell, Naruto. Things that I can't. That is a mother's role. So, I'm not doing this just for you. I'm doing it for Naruto. I will die for my son. It is my duty as his father. Okay, you guys are running out of time here. He's going numb. I can't believe how heavy his chakra is. Sign ceiling to seal the rest of Nine Tails inside Naruto. A ritual altar. He's planning to seal me up again. Not inside that baby. Krishna! was his father. Dying for him is my right. I'm his mother. It's my right, too. Fine. This is the first time I've lost an argument against you. It proves how serious you are. Thanks, Kushina. It's going to put mine, Kushina's chakra, into the seal. Okay, that should do it. Kushina, I'm launching the eight sign ceiling now. see him for a while. So let's tell Naruto what we want to say to him. Naruto, don't 
Don't be a piggy eater. Eat a lot. And grow big and strong. Make sure to bathe every day. And stay warm. Don't stay up late. Get plenty of sleep. Plus, make friends. You don't need tons, okay? Just a few that you can really trust. And your mom was bad at this. But study hard and learn your ninjutsu. Just everyone is good at some things and, and not so good at others. So even if things don't go well, don't get depressed, okay? At the academy, respect your teachers and those senior to you. Oh, and regarding the three prohibitions, be extra careful about loaning and borrowing money. <laughs> Make sure you save money from your mission pay. And don't start drinking until you're 21. Too much drink is bad for your body, so drink in moderation. And the most problematic, girls. I'm a girl, so I don't really know much about this. But at some point, you'll notice girls. And that's normal. Just be careful. Don't fall for the first girl that comes your way. Find someone like me. Plus, speaking of the three prohibitions, be wary of Master Jiraiya. You know... Ha! That's actually kind of funny. Naruto. There will be plenty of hard and painful times ahead. Take care of yourself. Make sure to have dreams and the confidence to make those dreams come true. So much. There's so so much there really there really is so much more I want I want to tell you I want to be with you longer I love you I'm sorry Minato I talk too much no it's all right Naruto My words to you as your father is ditto to what your loquacious mother said. <laughs> I am muted just for that. Hate sign ceiling. I'm sorry for making you the Nine Tails vessel and making you bear our burden. For not being able to be at your side as you grew up. And not giving you the love you needed. Don't apologize. Okay, sure. I went through a lot as a kid because I was in Jinchuriki. But I would never blame you or dad for that. So yeah, I never really had parents. Since, you know, after that day, you and dad weren't around. But now I do. You died for me, you and Dad. You sacrificed yourselves. Now I know, without a doubt, you always loved me. I'm... I'm happy. Naruto is such a good I'm kid. I'm glad I'm your kid. Minato, are you listening? Our homes. Did 
better reach our boy. Naruto! Thank you for letting me become a mother. And thank you for letting Minato become a father. Thank you so, so much. For being born. To us. Mom. From now on, I promise I'll eat veggies, not just ramen. <laughs> Don't put the veggies worry. in the ramen. I love bathing. I go to hot springs a lot too. And I sleep tons. In fact, I probably sleep too much. I've got lots of friends too. I wish you could have met them, Mom. Though there's one that I'm not getting along with right now. About my studies. Well, you feared right, Mom. But I'm okay with it, you know? That's not a good thing. You're supposed to achieve better Back when school. I was at the academy, lots went down with my teachers and mentors. But now, I do respect them. Master Jiraiya taught me the three ninja prohibitions. For sure, he was just like you described, Mom. But he also taught me how a ninja ought to live. He was a truly great ninja, you know? I... I'm Naruto Uzumaki, Leaf Ninja. My dream is to become Hokage, and to surpass all other Hokage. To become an even cooler guy than Dad, and an even more powerful ninja than you, Mom. Yeah! Whoa! What happened? Did you succeed? This and that. A lot of things. Yo! <laughs> I see. I get it. I understand. Your face, it's calm. Totally bland. So, so what the heck happened? We'll save the explanation for another occasion. All right? What? <laughs> you, you, Yamato is so out of the loop. He's like, what just happened? <laughs> Dad. Mom. You brought me into this world. Thank you. Chapter 4, The Birth of Naruto, done.